State lawmakers shot down several bills that would have changed the way we hold elections in Oklahoma. Capitol reporter Storm Jones is tracking them all from the state house. Yeah, there's a lot of interest in those bills today because at the end of the day, elections touch every facet of government from utilities to school boards and municipalities. Lobbyists representing those organizations packed the committee room this morning to get a front row seat. I don't see any advantage in my district. I don't think you're addressing my questions. I'm going to step down and I think you are too. The elections. Election, off election. Elections at every level. I'm trying to give information to voters. One bill would have required candidates to declare a party affiliation even for nonpartisan races. They're political. We're making a political choice every time. They are all political. I don't see the problem with that. Another would have required elections on off dates to receive 40% voter participation to be considered valid. If you will use a traditional election day, you do not have to hit as high a threshold. I don't think that school bonds or school boards or whoever should be punished in a way that's different from what we should. Representative Denise Crosswhite Hader also offering a bill that would ban school boards from appointing someone to a vacant seat. Declare your bill to have failed. Seeing no second, the bill will remain property of the committee. Seeing no second. All of those bills failed to make it out of committee. Bill will re remain property of the committee. A bill that would have clarified when a person convicted of a felony could once again vote failed three to four. And if we can't get bipartisan support, on it. God bless us. The committee advanced bills preventing private money from being donated to help conduct elections and another to reinforce existing voting practices. And there's several election bills coming up in a Senate committee tomorrow. We'll be following it all. At the state capitol, I'm Oklahoma's own Storm Jones.